Oh my gosh, I make it. It's the one, it's the one version of, it's the one version of um, what I made last night did, that didn't get broken in my cooler. But this is pink lemonade, and I made it in a concentrated. I'm going to give you guys some lemonade to end your, your day on and then show you a couple of, um, of my favorite packaged foods that I buy for my kids. I like to do all these things in, like, in a version that's, that you can make on your own, but sometimes, you know, if you want to supplement and buy some things from the store, you can do that. But kids like pink lemonade. I'm going to show you how I make it. It's very simple. Once I learned this trick, which I just learned, what, a week and a half ago? I haven't bought lemonade since, pink lemonade, because my kids don't drink dairy or soda or sports drinks. So what do they drink? Water and some lemonade. <laughs> I mean, we drink other things too, fizz, fizz sticks and homemade almond milk. But this, they're, we ordered this, and now I'm like, oh my gosh, that's all they make is pink lemonade. And it's so yummy, and there's no sugar. Okay, so this is so easy, you guys. Oopsie. Come down here. All right, so yeah, so you know what? I, well, I started making green lemonade for my kids because I like, I like to get greens in my kids as much as possible. So you can do this green or pink. Um, for Halloween, it's kind of fun to do the green one because it's green and you can make it a fun thing, you know. Um, pink lemonade is just always a hit because kids like that. They like the colors. But you can really get away with the green one at, at um, Halloween. Um, and so you just add, add the wheatgrass. The frozen ones, I get them uh, online. You can get them, also get them at Mother's. Make sure they're organic wheatgrass. And then just do the same thing I'm doing. Um, and you can make it green. It's kind of fun. But let's make it pink today. So basically, take one of these little gadgets. You can get them like, at the grocery store even now. Take a lemon and squeeze it. Get out your frustrations. Have your kids help you. It's all good. Right? Oh, it smells good, doesn't it? it I love lemons. Lemons are so good for you. And you know, people think because they're acidic, they're like, they're, they're like acid, but they're actually massively alkalizing for our bodies. So that's why I say drink lemon water in the morning. It's so good for you. It dumps your liver. It dumps your liver? Yeah. yeah. We all want dumped livers, right? Yeah. Dumping our livers is where we're going. This is, this is the next show. How to dump your liver. There's, there's 50 ways to love your liver. <laughs> ways to leave your liver <laughs> and we're going to talk about it at the next meeting at the next MIC view nobody's ever coming back are they this is it just just love us for who we are <laughs> this is it this is the end of the road for us I think. I'm having a good time this is it it's 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 in my kitchen from now on babe this is where, where it's happening nobody's coming back you're gonna have to watch us online watch us on YouTube okay so what am I doing I'm doing the the uh, uh, Pomegranates now. Who loves pomegranates? They're in season right now, actually. They're a fall food, and they're really great for you. Oh, my gosh. You talk about a superfood. Pomegranates are the best ever. So I just cut them, like, in little quarters. You see this? And then you just put them uh, pomegranate side down and squeeze them. And this is turning into pink lemonade. This is where the pink lemonade happens, okay? So you do that. We'll just do two of them for now, for time's sake. And do um, you know what? You do have to add some stevia. <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> okay, I do like stevia. I think I, you're right. This could be a problem. Okay, so um, that's, that's the next show. Don, 50 about ways it. to love your stevia. Detoxifies <laughs> from stevia. That could be a really crazy show. Okay. Now, isn't Dottie amazing? Look at all the stuff she brought. I brought a lot of stuff. It's awesome. This is how I learned so much in the last four years because of this woman. I love Thank ice. And, I love ice and stevia. Does that mean I have worms? No, I'm not sure. I heard that. You like ice, you have worms. I don't know where I heard that from, but I've been troubled by it ever since. Okay, now I'm not going to sleep. Let's don't do a body scan. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so I like ice. So what I do with my kids, I fill up one of their ice ice um, jars, like you know, that they take to school in the ice um, containers. I, I make the concentrate, and um, well, and then I fill it up with water. And so it goes. That was so awesome. And if it's too too weak, what do you do? You add more lemons. <laughs> if it's not sweet enough, you add more stevia. <laughs> 
And there you go. There's your pink lemonade, sister. Let's taste it. It is so good. We, I think we should share it with our friends. We should. My son loves this. I mean, I can't tell you how excited he is because he loves lemonade, and I always cringe buying it. Even the organic lemonade, I looked at the sugar content, and I would just be like, are you kidding me? And I couldn't get away from it. So now it's like, I'll make it every day. And I make it in this thing like this. And I have one for each of them. I'm like, here's your lemonade for the day. Okay, let's use this one. We haven't contaminated it. Tell me if it, if it needs anything, Tracy. Do we need any more stevia? It's perfect. Is it perfect? It is. It's perfect. Yay! Pink, see, pink, pink.